Hey there, and welcome to my James Joyce Ulysses course. I'm Adam Savage, and this is the introductory video. In this video, I'm going to cover what you can expect in this course, why you would take it, what uh, the time frame is for how long I will release these videos, and just what you can expect from the course. So. If you're coming to this video, you've probably either read or attempted to read Ulysses by James Joyce. It's a very long and difficult book, but it has a reputation as a classic, as one of the best books of the 20th century. It's like a high point for early 20th century literature, the modernist movement. And uh, you may feel like compelled to read it uh, as uh, if you like books or classics and you want to tackle it, but you've struggled with it, or maybe you've just you feel um, a little intimidated by it. Whatever the case may be, my goal in these videos is to make uh, the book accessible. Uh, not easy, there's always gonna be challenges and mysteries with it, but to make it so that you know where you can start and how you can navigate through the book. My hope is that by the end of these videos, uh, you'll be ready to start the book and just take it and then if you still have trouble, you'll know what videos to return to or what resources that I'm going to provide you uh, that you can turn to for more information. So I first read the book when I was 19 or 20. I had read, I think, Dubliners and A Portrait of the Artist as a Young Man, two other books by James Joyce at that point. And uh, those books were a little, they weren't, they weren't that hard. They were, there were moments that were difficult and were a little uh, challenging, but it wasn't anywhere near Ulysses. And when I got to Ulysses, I came to it because authors that I respected and admired, they recommended it a lot. And when I tried it, though, I, I just plowed through it in like three weeks or so. And I was, I was definitely challenged by the book. I, there were parts when I, I just did not know what was going on, who these people were, what was happening. And it was frustrating because there were other parts where I had no trouble at all. It was very clear what was going on. So there was something about the book that James Joyce, he knew how to write clearly and he chose at certain points to write in different styles and make it a little more challenging. So I was, um, I was frustrated, but I was also uh, compelled to look more into the book. I read a lot of books about it. I researched it and when I went back to read it again, I, I enjoyed it much more. And I've read it several times since then. I've listened to audiobooks about it, things like that. And that have, that have, those things have all helped a lot so that when I read it, in 2018, I read it twice, actually, two more times. And I enjoyed it more each time. It's just such a rich book that I, have, I could read it forever, over and over. And there are certainly parts, chapters, episodes that I appreciate more than others, but overall it's probably in my top three books and some days it's my favorite book of all time because it's just so, so good. And I really, that's what I want to give you in this, these videos, a way to make it one of your favorite books. It's a life-changing book. It can, it has just so much. It will change how you see so many things that, uh, I love it, and I, I really, if I can get that across to you, then I will have succeeded. That is my hope in these videos. My initial plan was to write this book, and I'm still writing it, about Ulysses. It's not just going to be about how to read Ulysses. It's going to be about learning and uh, how to tackle any difficult subject. Um, I won't go into too much into the book right now, but... Uh, it's coming along slowly and I just did not want to wait for the book to release these videos. I was going to do the videos to promote the book, but <clears throat> I'm not going to wait. I want to, I want to do these videos too much. And I know that by doing these videos and getting comments on my YouTube channel and other places that it'll help me make the book a better book. So if you have any comments, questions, feel free to leave them in the YouTube channel. It's probably the best way to contact me. Um, but I'm going to also put this on Udemy eventually when I finish the main bulk of the course and maybe release it as on, on BitTorrent somehow. I'll, I'll release it in different ways, but I think my YouTube channel is the main way to reach me. So leave a comment, questions, things you want me to touch on in the course. I would love to hear from you and let me know what you think. 
All right, so the structure of this course, I'm gonna do about maybe five to 10 videos to gently introduce you to the material of what the book is about, who the characters are, the structure of the book, and then I'm gonna go episode by episode through the book, there's 18 episodes, and just explain what is happening, where it's taking place, um, who the characters are, and what the particular hurdles of each chapter are, because some of them are certainly more uh, difficult than others. And then once I've done that, that'll probably run, you know, about 30 uh, videos, the introductory material and the episode summaries. Once I finish that, then I'm going to say the course is quote unquote finished. But in reality, I'm going to keep adding videos for as long as I'm doing videos. Uh, I have so many ideas, just any little nuance in the book that I want to touch on or any aspect of it, I'm just going to do a video. I have ideas for interviews, people I want to uh, interview about Ulysses, people that admire Joyce or have said they admire Joyce. <laughs> uh, I would just like to make this as interactive and um, uh, multifaceted as possible to give you like tons of material that you can approach the book from so many different angles. That is my plan. And, uh, but my goal is in 2019 to finish those initial 30 or so videos and get to the end of the book. And if I can do that, then I will be happy. And if not, I'll release it as I release it, but I would like to get it done in 2019 if possible. So if you want to see what the latest status of the course is, the best way is to go to my YouTube channel and look for the playlist, look under playlist for, you know, the James Joyce Ulysses course. Uh, I don't know what I'm going to call it, James Joyce for Beginners or Ulysses for Beginners or A Reader's Guide to Ulysses, something like that. It'll be pretty obvious. I only have like five playlists at this point. So yeah, that's the introduction to the course. I hope uh, you stick around. I think it's going to be an awesome course. I'm going to learn a lot. I hope you learn a lot. Um, if you want to support the course, there's a lot of different ways to motivate me to keep making these videos. I, I live off your enthusiasm. So if you like this video, if you like the course, like as many videos as possible, subscribe. That helps a lot. Um, if you're watching this on Udemy or if you want to go to Udemy, leave a hopefully positive review for one of my courses. I have a, another course on uh, Manga Studio, Clip Studio, 5, Clip Studio Paint, which is a uh, a course about making comics so it's a very different course but in reality it's kind of related because they're both about media right so that may interest you i did that a few years ago it's a little less polished i don't know if this is polished this is mainly just me talking to the camera but i'm going to include include uh maybe music maybe uh some pictures maps to help you understand the book there's there's just so much in the book i, I love this book i love this course um, we're going to have a lot of fun. Um, another way that you can help me out is um, I have a Patreon account. I'll leave the link here or it'll also be in the information for this video on YouTube. Uh, most likely you will be the first patron I have if you do decide to support me. That would definitely motivate me. I'm a struggling artist, writer, musician. Any help, even a dollar a month or whatever the minimum that Patreon allows, I will thank you so much for that. And if you leave comments there, I will certainly appreciate it. And uh, if you have any video ideas, I will make a video on that as it relates to Ulysses. I have a further idea about doing a course for Finnegan's Wake. That would be awesome. That book I, I still struggle with, but I feel like I'm getting more uh, acclimatized to it as I've reread Ulysses. Each of jo Joyce's books is um, an expansion on his previous material and an expansion on uh, basically English literature up to that point, uh, the idea of the human story. And he is always broadening his ideas of what story can be. So I would love to do the, something on Finnegan's Wake in the future. If you support me on Patreon, that would really motivate me to do that. Um, other than that, I also have a Twitter. Here it is, I guess. I don't really tweet there at this point, but if I get followers, I guess I will. That would motivate me. You know, anything you can do to support me and help me, I appreciate it. But enough about that. The course is free. If you're just here to enjoy it, that's great. Let's get to the meat and potatoes of this uh, course. It's going to be awesome. Stick around.